I have learned that the greater part of our misery or unhappiness is determined not by our circumstance but by our disposition said Martha Dandridge Custis Washington born on 2nd June 1731 in Chestnut Grove died on 22nd May 1902 in Virginia in the United States of America was the wife of George Washington, the first president of the United States. I have always watched. The presentation is very, very important. And that presentation, nobody can do as beautiful as the Japanese presentation on foot, table, house. They, can you believe they call it as the flower girl for the receptionist? And uh, they said, the first impression is the best impression and they make sure that the reception is so beautifully kept anybody sees it even if they wanted to make a complaint they forget about the complaint the first entry is very very important the entry part is very important and every part of your area is kept so beautiful i have learned said martha washington that the greater part of our misery or unhappiness is determined not by our circumstance but by our disposition. How we keep things, disposition, how we decorate it up. Like this, they teach you if money comes in the hand of a rich, they double it up. But in India, our pranayama is taught that mathematics. Without mathematics, nothing works. But then people kept on taking their salaries. For anything, everything they look into the money. But if they do not know to use it, then that's where the misery comes. In our pranayama, we teach that we inhale one. That means if you take one rupee, retention four, you work for four times in the retention. Past, present, future stops. In the retention, you can't even breathe. You are just a karma. You get deeply involved in that particular job. So that one will lead to four. You make four times that money. And then you release through your other side two. That means when you make four, you immediately release two to give to the poor or to whom you want it. Again, you start from this side two. You work four times, it makes eight. That multiplication was there. That disposition was there. Keeping things in, must work very hard. Four times, always four times of what you get in. Before you go to open the mouth. You get the money, you don't even open your mouth. When the breath stops for a second, that disposition was there in India. Keeping things in proper order before the rain comes. I've been screaming at the top of my voice and um, the Deputy Chief Minister of Karnataka said, yes, we'll have a task force before the rains like what SM Krishna Ministry has done it. They have not even started. Rains come, storms, heavy wind, people will suffer without water, no blanket, no umbrellas, no raincoats were given. Drains were not being cleared. Drains cleaning is very important. So it's not only the government's job. If people also, that this circumstance is not very important. Disposition is very important. In front of the inside and outside, yin and the yang. Positive and negative only can create electricity. When you have one house inside, you work four times outside. Then you can see the two becoming so beautiful. Yes, you work hard to make sure outside your house and you clean up all the drains and beautify outside the house, the tree, water the tree. Look at the beautiful birds, put the stones in the mud and the sand, beautiful how you keep it inside. Once we do that, I think there is no misery. Our misery is whatever little we get it, we should be happy. Whether it is small or medium or large. Hence, the sloka come, came. Purnamada, Purnamida, Purna, Purnamuda Shiddhi, Purnasya, Purnamadaya, Purnameva Shiddhi. Whether it is a small circle or a medium circle or a big circle, you should be happy.
but I enjoy that circle, beautiful, give a finishing touch. In our sports, whenever I was an athlete, when I was in school and the college, my athletic master called us the physical education master always taught us, whatever you do, don't worry about the gold, silver, bronze. Giving a finishing touch is very, very important in style, finding out whether you will be able to run that 1,500 meters, 3,000 meters or 5,000 meters or 10,000 meters. Yes, once you know your bladder capacity, you relax and you run and always I we won. Yes, we won. First, second, we, all the students will be running. But when we relax and we run, we always got it. That relaxation will come once you understand your power or when you get it. I have learned that the greater part of our misery or unhappiness is determined not by circumstance but by a disposition. Circumstance is not that, that when an, all the people around you, they'll be able to help you. Help yourself. Yes, when the teacher teaches you one, you go back and you work hard four times. Yes, you put it back into your house as homework. They ask you to write the homework in your notebook. But I'm asking you, you go back home, what teacher has taught, try to find out where you can put those things. Don't go back to sleep, don't go back to take a cricket bat. First finish that. In the beginning, it might take four hours or eight hours. If you spend five hours in the school, you might need five hours in the house. But later on, you can know it just takes five minutes of your time in the house because everything is in proper order. You have to only go, go every day. Don't do it like my workers in my ashram. They go once in 15 days, but the grass has grown so much. Then it takes a huge amount of time to clear up. I said, take the grass cutting machine. Every day, one round. Every day, one round. You can find out unnecessary weeds have been removed. There's hardly any time. It's just becoming a walk, just a walk and everything. But if you don't do it every day, then the greater part of misery or unhappy determined not by our circumstance, but by our disposition. Every day practicing prana. Prana in here. One retention, four exhale, two. That means whenever you get one, keep in mind that is mathematics. Without mathematics, life doesn't move. Everybody knows, but you have not presented the foot beautifully. The way food is presented by Padma to me, even if I am not hungry, I intend to take because it has got a yellow, a green, a red varieties of two to three, four, five, and the food is very little, but the the presentation was very beautiful. I remember one of my Manipuri uh, Nagaland Nagaland uh, Nagaland students auntie. She walked in the Saint John's Hospital, and I was shocked. She just walked in, and the uh, security guard saluted, thinking she is a doctor. The way she just <laughs> we all go there. They say, where is the card? Stop. You're not allowed to go. Disposition, your dress on what occasion to wear. Forget about what others are thinking. For death ceremony, we have a beautiful uniform. For weddings, there should be a beautiful uniform. Yes, it's practiced. Yes. Like that one one occasion, you dress up according to that circumstances. I think you don't feel sad. You maintain your body. Mathematics tells you how to maintain your body. So, you know, for this height, what is your weight? You will measure. If you know to measure, tomorrow when money comes in your hand, you will measure. And when you give equally to other people and you walk into that village, you always say, hands just folded. Yes. Two days back, I went to the main, I was passing through. I didn't go to the village. I was passing through uh, the nearest village called Margunda Hanli. And the road, there was a small road block because a tractor was blocking my path. And I didn't even horn, I just stood inside. One man came with a finger and pointed at me like this. I thought, oh, what did I do wrong? I did not, I don't know why he pointed, no idea. He pointed to shout at me. I, I did not even horn. And the very next moment, he came near, he saw me through the glass, his finger slowly moved. And he became Namaste and smiled. Namaste so much. Immediately all the ladies next door who was working on the field all came around. Namaste so much. Namaste so much. Because you know, I shared what little my I gave to my children. I told them, can you give a little from what I given you? So everybody put a small, small tooth, we call it, a small drop. And we gave to the neighborhood village. We felt very good. Immediately the tractor was moved to the side. They pushed the tractor. 
gave us to be a disposition. Please try to understand. That makes us happy. That makes you healthy. That makes you the richest. Martha Washington said, I have learned that the greater part of our misery or unhappiness is determined not by our circumstance, but by our disposition.